All right, so tonight we can report that sources privy to a meeting between WIPA leader Kalonzo Musioka and other Azimio One Kenya Coalition Party leaders suggest that the WIPA leader could get more slots in the cabinet should he rejoin the party. KTN's political affairs reporter Daniel Karioki explains Kalonzo is a step closer to rejoining Azimio after the SAID meeting. <laughs> Waipa leader Kalonzo Musioka has left Kenyans guessing his next political move, having in the past year made remarks that he later walked back on. Kalonzo Musioka has called leaders from the lower eastern region into a meeting on Friday for the community to find the way forward a day before he presents his presidential papers to IEBC on Saturday. It is not clear if he will be seeking to convince the community to back his intention to give a second stab at the presidency or seek their concurrence if he can go back to the president Uhuru Kenyatta and Raila Odinga led Azimio La Umoja coalition. Yes, However, details of a meeting between President Kenyatta, Raila Odinga and Kalonzo held in an attempt to retain Kalonzo in Azimio have emerged. Kalonzo is said to have lobbied for several slots should Azimio form next government in the next election. Kalonzo wants to be the chief cabinet secretary and also to be in charge of the foreign affairs docket, while his party should also be allocated the ministries of energy, water and health, among other planned positions as a condition to rejoin Azimio. Another meeting is said to firm up the issues and agree on the slots with sources claiming that Kalonzo is pushing to have the infrastructure docket. <laughs> the Friday's meeting will be key. If Kalonzo gets the blessings to run from Ukambani's support base, he will have caused a huge political move given that the Azimio La Umoja has been hoping to have him on their side so as to consolidate the Ukambani vote. Was Kalonzo Musioka offered a chief minister's position in a power sharing agreement of Azimio? The answer is no. no. Let's show each other respect so that we do things correctly. And we start practicing, growing our democracy. You know, uh, our democracy it seems to be stagnating because of this kind of commitments which people never own. There is a dispute uh, resolution mechanism under that alliance. So we are asking our party leader that we do reconsider uh, the, possibi the possibility of having further discussions on this coalition arrangement. Should he walk back to Azimio, he will give an edge to the Uhuru and Raila coalition a much-needed political boost that could tilt the scale in their favor. Daniel Karioki, KTN News. So away from that story, definitely a developing one, and we we'll continue giving you a good coverage, only the best way that we can. But then Azimio Umoja One Kenya Coalition Brigade 